One of the questions I'm asked most often is how to rearrange navigation links in the menu over here and how to change this from horizontal to vertical navigation. So I'm going to show you how to do that. You'll notice that whenever you add in a new page, i go ahead and add in a new page. I'll just call it new page. Google defaults to adding a link to that new page for me in my navigation. So not only has it made a new page, but it did make a link to that page in my navigation menu. So that's nice that it's set to do it automatically. But however, because it is set to do it automatically, it just alphabetizes these, which isn't always ideal. Maybe I wanted photos right after home and important files at the end. So here's how you can edit your sidebar and rearrange these links. So first click the edit sidebar link and you'll see the navigation gadget essentially here and you'll click edit. Now if you want to change the way your pages are organized you're going to need to uncheck automatically organize navigation. What's important to know is as soon as you uncheck this Google is not automatically going to both make your page and make a link for it. So you'll have to do that manually from now on. So I'm going to go ahead and uncheck automatic. Here's the pages that are currently in here. If there wasn't one showing that I had created, I would click add a page and I would put it in this menu here. So when you click add a page, if you don't see a page that you want, it brings up a list of all the pages in your site. You can click on the one you want and click OK. To rearrange these pages, you just highlight the one you want and use the up and down arrows to rearrange. So if I wanted photos up at the top, I can go like so. So I'm going to go ahead and click OK. Save my changes, go back and look at my site, and you'll see my links are now not alphabetically organized. But again, just as a reminder, when I click to add a new page, I'll call this one second page, and I click the red create button, my page has been created, but Google did not automatically make a link for it over here in my navigation because I unchecked the automatically organize my navigation for me. So. Um, I will need to go in and go in to edit my sidebar and if I want to link to this second page I'm going to go ahead and have to add that manually so I don't see second page listed here I'm going to go ahead and add a page it's going to bring up all my pages I'll select second page and say OK there it is I can use the up and down arrows to decide where I want it and if there's ever a page I didn't want linked in the navigation maybe I don't want music files showing I can just highlight this one and click the X that did not delete the page it only deleted the link to the page. When you're done, click OK, save your changes, and click on the name of your site to get back to your site. And now you can see that the music page is no longer linked over here in my navigation menu, which means it's definitely hard to find. And um, I can click on sitemap to locate it. It would probably be a page that I'd already have linked somewhere else, but you can see it's still here in my sitemap, so I still am able to locate it. So that is how you edit your vertical navigation, but what if you want to have horizontal buttons going across the top instead so that you have more page across your screen for content? So if you want to change this to not be a vertical navigation menu, here's how you can do that. I'm going to go ahead and use the edit sidebar link. I'll show you another way to get to this menu that I'm going to in a moment here. If I click edit sidebar, I'm kind of just dropped right down into um, my site layout feature. So if I were just to click edit the navigation here, I'm still going to be stuck with the vertical navigation. If I want to switch to horizontal, that's a layout change. So I'm going to click the change site layout button. And then there are several things I can adjust as I go along here, but typically the, the main thing I'm going to do is switch my navigation bars in this area. So I'm going to check that I want horizontal navigation instead. You can still have a sidebar. It's not going to be for links that would be redundant but you could put other things on the left or right that would carry over from every page maybe quick links or something I don't like the look of that so I typically always uncheck sidebar so I just have horizontal and then I'm going to click OK save my changes and look for the name of my site so I can go back and see what it looks like so now I can see I have horizontal navigation or at least an area for it and my vertical navigation is gone but none of my pages are linked so I need to go ahead and manually add those in so how do I do that there is no edit navigation link up here in the horizontal navigation so to find that a different way to find it you can go to your more manage site again we're looking for that site layout feature so I'll scroll down a little bit it's third from the bottom and now this should look familiar it should, it should say instead of saying edit navigation it says edit horizontal navigation content 
and this is exactly like the window we used before. So if a page is not showing in your navigation, you add it. It's going to bring up a list of all your pages. Click OK. Add another page. It's a little tedious. You have to do them one at a time, but typically this is something you do when you set up your site and then you're kind of done with it so you don't have to keep doing this often over and over. Just maybe every time you add a new page to your site, well, you need to go back in. I see I added music twice. All right, so I've got I've got a few in here. You can see I put music in twice. So I'm just going to delete it, and then I can use the up and down arrows again to rearrange. So I'm going to put photos right after home. So I'm going to click OK. I'm going to save my changes. Click the name of my site to get back to it to view it. And now you can see I have lovely little horizontal navigation buttons going across the top, which is very handy because now I have all this space here for which to add content. So that is how you edit and change your navigation links from vertical to horizontal.